Hey everybody, so uh, I've been working on the new Proton Pack uh, for about the last two days. Um, a little bit of a mess in wires, but uh, just a quick walkthrough. Um, so the main heart of the pack is we have three components here. We have a SparkFun Wave Trigger with a SD card. Uh, this is going to run on 12 volts and uh, provides all the sounds. Um, I'm amplifying the sound through a add a Adafruit um, Max 9744. This is the same amp I use on Chopper and R2D2. And we're just using a, I believe this is a 10 watt uh, speaker. Yeah, 10 watt speaker I got from Amazon. Um, in the past, Proton Packs, you had to have a dual, dual switch, dual throw switch, and dual throw. So this Part here got really crowded really fast um, but much like my 2016 pack I'm using a Arduino Uno um, to control all the functions uh, so this sends the signal to the speak to the um, sound card um, and tells it what sound to play this is also controlling all my uh, NeoPixel lights so here you see the ones for the cyclotron, and here you see the ones for the um, power cell. Uh, so those will sit. Uh, power cells, the thing right here, and the cyclotrons right here. I still have to add the uh, neopixels and lights for the gun, but at this point those are pretty straightforward. And you can see I have line after line of code to make this work. Um, so just quick uh, look at the functions we have going. Uh, so first off, we'll turn the pack on. This will be done through this switch here in, when it's assembled. So it does play the uh, startup sound. Um, and then we do have the added feature of a uh, four switch so instead of having to turn the pack on and off I can just uh, close a switch again this will be in the gun sorry wrong thing and it forces the lights and sound to go through their uh, reboot sequence um, the pack also has the fire which right now I have programmed to speed up the uh, lights in the pack and then once I release, it does the cooldown sound. Um, one final feature I have on the pack is uh, something I found was uh, very neat to have on the 2016 pack is uh, I do have the music at the push of a button. Uh, just in case there's copyright issues. So that's it. Um, I have to 3D print the brackets and everything before I can mount it into the pack. Um, it's going to be a few weeks. I got to get some stuff done for celebration and uh, get a good grasp on some other stuff for Momocon. Um, so that's it. Um, some exciting stuff coming up, so stay tuned.